Hey everyone, welcome back to the range. It's a little cold, 40, 45 degrees outside today, but I got some ammunition to test for you. This is from our good friend Sam at SG Ammo. This is the Fioki IVI M855 62 grain ball. We have our four standard barrel lengths that we've been using, 10, 16, 20, and 22. Do an accuracy test as always. We have our Pro Chrono Digital, approximately 10 to 12 feet. Like I said, it's 45, maybe 50 degrees for lucky outside today. Had some time to get this in. It's a little cold, but we'll do it anyways. Up first as always is our 10 inch M85 pat. I'd really like to replace this with a uh, 10 inch AR upper so I can put a good sight on it so I can actually hit things with this at longer distances for armor testing. 2496. 2496 again. 2506. 2478. 2478 again. 2478 again. 2478 again. 2473. 2482. 2492. That's it. That's pretty consistent. Now our 16 inch stag, one and nine twist barrel. Look at that, EOTech battery's dead again. Doesn't surprise me. 2930. 2949 again 2943 2936 2936 again 2917 2923 2956 and finally our 20 inch mixmaster AR this has a 1 and 9 twist as well 1 and 9 27 2 3023 3044 3167 3182 3115 3182 
31-15 yet again. Thirty-one twenty-two. Thirty-one sixty-seven. So here's our Fiocchi sixty-two grain SS one hundred and nine, a little over two and a quarter. This is at a hundred yards now with the twenty-two inch Thompson Center Compass. We'll take a second string here. Just starting to use this for accuracy now. Minimal wind, like I said, about 45, 50 degrees outside. This is our third grouping, right around 1.86 inches at 100 yards. TC compass, 22 inch, one and nine twists, minimal wind, 50 degrees outside. I'll take that. Well, there you guys have it. Those are solid velocity numbers from this ammunition. Good function, it's M855 ball. Accuracy wise, we were right around two inches. Hard to say whether that's good or not in that gun. We just started using the TC Compass for accuracy at 100 yards because we got a scope on it. So we'll have to see how other M855 ball loadings do as we test them. Again, I'd like to thank Sam at SG Ammo for providing us with ammunition test. You all for watching. Until next time, catch you at the range.